Hey, Twitter world. Don't pet the llama. A pan-gender octopus who roams the cosmos in search of love. I'm never going to look at butt plugs the same. Apparently, ducks are rapists. I'm really uncomfortable with this conversation. You know, it's definitely been an experience for you with Gonzo, and not saying it's been all positive or all negative, but I'm sure you've learned stuff from it, and I'm sure you treat Charlie a little bit differently after... Oh, Char real quick, Charlie is this cute little dog that Jen's parents have. He's absolutely adorable. Yeah, Charlie is same age as Gonzo, actually. Nowhere near the same yeah, size. Yeah, Charlie about... is a mutt. He is a beagle rat terrier. <laughs> but he he doesn't really look like a beagle. He looks more like... Um, like, a, like a wiener dog. Um, he's a, He looks more like a cross between, yeah, like a wiener Adoption. dog. And what are the jumping... The jumping dogs um, that are like really Jack like, Russell. Yeah, Jack, uh, Jack Russell. That's what they thought he was at first. Yeah. So that would make sense. His yeah, co his his coloring. Yeah, too. he's definitely Red more like looking like a Jack Russell and a weenie dog mix. Yeah. So the cutest little thing ever. And um, when my parents kind of adopted him, kind of sorta, because mm -hmm. um, it was my sister's boyfriend, and they ended up getting him from, from him, and. Uh, I remember seeing him for the first time, and he was the cutest little thing. Like, when you say that Gonzo could fit in your palm of your hand, mm -hmm. like, to your hands, and then mm -hmm. a beanie, same thing. Like, yeah. little Charlie was the size Charlie. of my hand. He was the cutest little thing, and he just... Oh, you mean, like, yeah. this weekend? <laughs> yeah, he likes... He's like a little miniature coyote. He'll yeah. howl. Yeah. He's very cute. He'll do the full howl. Real. So we go... We do a little howl. <laughs> And then he'll go back on his back legs and do the little howl too. It's really cute. And we were over there what couple, last weekend. Last we were weekend. over there last weekend, and uh, he did a little howl. And so it was me, your parents, and then your sister too, and and yeah. you obviously. Yeah. So uh, we were all there howling with, or trying to get Charlie to howl. And then we did. I, I did a. He was following me, back and forth. And then I did a little. He just like it was the <laughs> tiniest, and he just like looked at all of us like. Can I do this? Like, what? <laughs> it was really, really cute. Uh, yeah, okay. so he was my first. I just said cute. I need to, like, yeah. make sure, like, you know, feel. I'm going to be okay, a man. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cute. So he was, like, my first kind of experience with a dog. Yeah. But that was already when I was moved out of the I, house. I and I was already. Like this now for the rest of the podcast. <laughs> I was, I think, just out of college or still in college when yeah, and you say you I think I came home, home and, and he was there and I'm like oh my gosh it's the cutest little thing ever but he still looks like a puppy because he's still small yeah he's but he's he's awesome though he he does this thing where he uh he takes his to anytime you throw a toy and he goes running after it he has to lick every spot that that toy bounced off of every on the carpet the wall, the wall everything. The bookshelf so anything it bounced definitely off. special he's def but him and gonzo would probably be uh like the best of friends if they got over the big little but thing he is so yeah, yeah. uh charlie is really afraid of big yeah. dogs because he had bad experience with one attacking him so one of the funniest things that i about charlie is the opening the presents during christmas Oh, I know. Uh, what your mom ha like wraps a present? Yeah, my mom he... will wrap Charlie's presents because he's a uh, he's you know part beagle, so he loves like to dog. sniff oh, yeah, out yeah, yeah. stuff and yeah. and go after it and dig up stuff. So yeah, he can sniff out his presents, like even like toys, treats that are packaged, everything. Yep. He'll he'll sniff them out underneath the tree. And he'll go under the tree, find through all the presents, and then grab the one <laughs> present that he smells as his, drag it out, and then start opening it. And then she'll have to rewrap it and rehide <laughs> it. It's like a game, I guess. It's funny. Um, but yeah, Gonzo just sits there and laughs at us when we're you know farts in the room while we're wrapping presents. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If we float your boat, make sure to subscribe here. For more awesomeness in your ear holes, click one of these videos here. You just gotta follow the red arrow and poke it. Poke it real good. You're supposed to poke the video, not me, babe. I was.